So we're playing over like one note, right? We're doing like something like that. So the cool thing is when you're playing over root and a fifth, a power chord, right? You actually have the freedom to do whatever you want. Like you can play major, you can play minor, you can play dominant. So do regular power chord. Right? Well, check it out. Here's what it sounds like. Right? That's dominant. Right? But at the same time, there's there's no primary chord tone in there. There's no secondary chord tone. There's no third, there's no seventh, just the root and shift. Okay. So we can do minor too. Let's do mine. Alright, here's major. Alright? So that, that's the whole idea. So so if you're if you're in a rock band, you actually have more freedom than what you would think because you're not playing over uh, you're not playing over a full chord. And from my limited limited experience, when you're playing in a rock band, you have more freedom in that way. So, so since rock, I guess the definition of rock and roll, in my opinion, is, is the exact opposite of what you're supposed to do. It's kind of like showing up on time, you know? Like you're supposed to show up on time. But who wants to do that, you know? Okay. <laughs> minor chords. So let's see what Mike does over here. Let's noodle here, you know? Say we got. 